All right, this video tutorial is for those of you that are using Chromebooks to submit your PDF assignments in dollars and cents or interpersonal relationships or anything that you have to submit a PDF file for. Uh, we're going to take a look at Chapter 3 because this particular student has already done everything in Chapter 2. All right, uh, which lesson in Chapter 3 have you not done? Okay, so we're going to start here with the Chapter 3 Lesson 1 text review. All right, so we have this open. And whenever you scroll down in here, remember that you always have a PDF file to open. So we're going to click on that. Now, ordinarily, I would tell you not to edit in the browser, but we're going to edit this one in the browser. Uh, we're going to pretend that you are watching the video and remember the video files or you do those the same way, whether it's a laptop or a Chromebook, but we're going to pretend that you are editing your document in here. And we're going to scroll down and find where we need to put an answer. All right. And right here. All right. So in the video, you would know what those things are that are your answers that go here, but I'm just going to put the words type here and type here. And you guys are going to have to figure out what the answers are on your own. And then right here, we're going to type our answer here. And we're going to type our answer here. All right, now, um, we're going to scroll down just a tiny bit so that we can see the answer here. And I don't think there's a place to type anything there. All right, now. On your Chromebook, there is a little button above the number six that looks like a window. You see that button, guys? It's a little button that looks like a window. In order to take a screenshot, a picture of your whole screen, you're going to hold the control button, which is at the bottom left-hand corner, and then push that window button at the top. And then it's going to show you screenshot taken, show in folder, or copy to clipboard. We're going to copy it to your clipboard. So that means that you have a picture of your answers that are on this page. And then you can scroll down and here's another set of answers that you have to type in. So we're going to we're going to type here and we're going to type some more and then type some more. And then we're going to take another screenshot when you're done putting that in. And remember, it was the control and the window button. And again, it's going to say screenshot taken, copy to clipboard. Now, let's pretend that you have answered all of the document, all of the document that you need to answer. So we're going to go back to our assignment. And you're going to attach files to it. So you're going to browse my computer right here. And you're going to look right here at the top where it has the word recent. And if you'll click where it says recent, there are your two screenshots that we took. So you're going to click on the first one and then you're going to use the control key and you're going to click on the second one. And that will select both of them. And if there's more than that, you're going to hold down the control key and click all of those screenshots until you get them. And then you're going to click the word open. And if you will look at your assignment, you have your screenshots right there with your answers. Easy enough? All right. And then we're going to click submit. I'm not going to submit this assignment because he's going to have to do that. All right. Does everyone see, do you guys see what to do on that? Are there any questions? Is there something that you need to know more about? All right. I think that's going to make it fairly easy for you guys to get those in. I'm going to show you one other thing on here. If you are using a Chromebook, if you want to just take a snip, there is a way to do that. It does not have a snipping tool, but you can take a snip. If we want to take a picture of the screen, we use the control and we use the window button and took the whole thing and we copy that to our clipboard. If all we want is just a small part of it, you can use on the left hand side here the control and the shift and the window button. And then you take your cursor over there, 
you click your mouth, uh, your keypad button down here, your touchpad, and then you click and drag to highlight what you want to take the picture of, and it will only take that part. And again, <laughs> you copy it to your clipboard. Okay? Any questions on this?